What are some of the main risks? So volatility, uh, as I said, you've got that long term, and I guess I'm stressing here for Africa, it's got to be a long term investment. You've got these long term secular trends, but within that you're going to see quite a bit of, I guess let's call it cyclical volatility. So you've got to be prepared to sit it out. You've got to be a long-term investor. I, I wouldn't con even consider coming into Africa, ex-South Africa, if your time horizon is less than, say, five, ten years. And then, to a large degree, a lot of the countries are still dependent on commodities and commodity prices. Uh, the most obvious ones are the likes of Nigeria, oil, Zambia, copper. I'd say oil's the big one. Uh, that impacts a lot of the country's outlooks. That's a risk, still very much tied to commodity prices, but it's changing. It's changing rapidly. The countries are developing, the markets are developing. So in, in, in time, you're going to have much less reliance on those commodities. And obviously governance as well. Governance is definitely a risk. Look, it's obviously a risk in South Africa as well with what we've seen over the last year or two. But it is more of a risk than South Africa, but it is changing. I would say it's South Africa... You could argue is maybe not improving, let's put it that way. Africa's definitely improving. We're seeing more and more democratic change. Uh, even countries like Nigeria, in which were, you'd see regular coups, they've had now a couple of democratic elections in which the political party has changed and they've gone off fine without a hitch. And even from a company-specific view, the, a key focus on what we're looking for when we look at the quality of the companies, quality of management and quality of their governance, there's a lot still to be designed. There's a lot of improvement still to come, but it is improving rapidly. I've been looking at Africa for 10 years now, and within that time, there's been a noticeable improvement in access to information as well as quality of governance within those companies. There's still, there's still some issues. There's a couple of companies that that have, like South Africa, has, has, has some issues, have been suspended recently, etc. But it's, it's on the up, it's improving.